Welcome to my kitchen. This is my favorite place to be. It is also known as the headquarters of In the Garden Apothecary. And today I thought I would film a behind the scenes of how I make all of my herbal medicine. This process is equal parts ritual and science. So this is a batch of my Euphoria tincture, which is blue lotus, butterfly blue pea, and vanilla that has been brewing in glycerin for eight weeks or two moon cycles. And the reason that we want to brew the medicine this long and sometimes even longer is so that we can get all of the strong constituents from the plants into the glycerin or alcohol. I make all of my herbal medicine in ceremony, blessing the space with sage and calling in intentions of healing. I do this to honor those who grew and harvested these plants and those who have been making herbal medicine much longer than I have. This is a process of remembering. I then strain the tincture through a nylon cheesecloth into a Pyrex beaker, which is easy to then pour into the dosage bottles. Just look at that beautiful blue color coming from the butterfly blue pea. By the way, if anyone wondered, this is what my setup looks like. I like to fill my bottles either using my kitchen table or countertop since it gives more space for moving the bottles around when you fill them and this is just a long process of me filling the bottles. I really think that filling should maybe be a soft skill that I can add to my resume with all of these bottles that I have filled over my lifetime. And once I have finished filling, I go through and make sure each bottle is filled to the same amount. You want to leave a little bit at the top because the pipette will also displace some of the tincture. Since I am a one-woman show, I also design and print my labels at home. I use Avery and purchase blank labels, which has saved me hundreds of euros. And it's easy to just save the PDF and put the labels in. As an aside, this printer is the bane of my existence since it has to be set up like a brand new printer every single time I want to print something. However, look at how the labels come out. They're gorgeous and completely customizable. It's great because I can print small amounts since I'm always working with small batches so I don't have to purchase hundreds of labels at a time from Avery. And now I just apply the labels to the bottles and I have a fresh batch of tinctures to add to my online apothecary and to bring with me to the festive upcoming markets. Thanks so much for watching!